Hello everybody, how are you guys doing today? Welcome back to my channel. My name is So by me, Juliana Leonard. For those of you, excuse me, who have not subscribed to my channel, please do so. And do not forget to click the like button. Do not forget. It's very, very important. So let's go straight to what we have today. Today we'll be decorating this t-shirt. As you guys can see, if you look through the video, you see white t-shirt lying on my table. We'll be decorating it today with a cordless fabric. Card, this beautiful cordless fabric. So, yeah. How to put embellishment, how to decorate your shirt, your t-shirt. It doesn't matter the color. Just to put a beautiful look. So now I've already cut out my cordless fabric and I'll go ahead and place it on top of my, my t-shirt. I'll go ahead, I already place it now. So now you have to check the side to make sure everything is equal. You have to use your tape to make sure everything on the both sides are equal you see or you can you can eyeball it as well yeah so now everything is equal so all, the next step is for you to check your mind like you know exactly what you want think about what exactly am i going to create what shape or what like what do I do you have in mind to create with this uh, fabric it doesn't matter it can be less uh, this cordless or any less fabric or your Ankara or any whatsoever you want but you have to be creative with it think exactly what exactly do I want or the shape in order to put make this uh, t-shirt beautiful to bring more beautiful attracting look to it so now I've placed my fa my fabric. It's just like a rectangular shape now. So what I have in mind is to make it as a, like a bow tie shape. So now let's go ahead and do it. I have to start to gather, gather it gradually. Gather and gather. And you have to check the center point of your fabric. You have to check the center point of your decorating fabric. So now you've got you gather I've gathered my fabric together. As you guys can see, now we have a like a bow tie shape, a bow shape, a bow shape. So now all you have to do now is to use your use your glue. I'll use glue, but rather later I'll use uh, my thread to stitch it around. I'll go ahead now and use the glue to stick it on my t-shirt. Stick it together on my t-shirt. And after that, I'll make I'll use my needle to sew together the bow to make it as that to allow the shape to come out properly. So I'll go ahead and uh, use the glue. I'll come back and show you guys. You can do this with anything you want. This is all about being creative. Creativity. You can do it with, on, in, on any fabric of your choice, whatever you want. So I'll come back and show you guys. Yes, I've uh, finished placing them with my glue. This glue is um, it's a fabric glue. It's a fabric glue. All you need is glue. Of your, You can use a glue gun glue gun you guys know what is glue gun and or you can get any of any fabric glue so now i'll finish placing the the cordless on top of my my t-shirt so all i have to do now is to i'll go again and i'll use this uh needle to stitch this around this place the bow center the center of the bow i'll make it to look nice like i said before this is all about creativity you have to make something nice something whatever it is any image of your choice whatever you like either flower you can choose to go with flower or make your fabric into flower you see 
I'm going now just to stitch it together to make that to create that shape of a bow to make it outstanding and beautiful. So I'll go ahead and there uh, sew it together. You can choose to if you don't have glue, it's optional. You can choose to use your needle to sew down to sew down your cobbler or to sew down the fabric. But today I chose to use uh, my glue and my needle. I'm doing I already uh, glued down some of some part of the the lace and now I'm using my needle to stitch it around to make it um, nice and beautiful. So after this, after this, I'll go ahead and that. When you are stitching it, make sure you are not, uh, the shape is still intact. Whatever shape you are making is still intact. Do not allow your stitches to ruin your design or your decoration. So make sure everything is still intact as you are stitching or as you're gluing down the the fabric so now i finish uh, putting the uh, sewing it down i'll go along one more one more time too sew it one more time onto the fabric onto my t-shirt like I said before, you can go with uh, use your needle to do this. It's it's up to you. Whatever you want to do, you do it. All you we need is just uh, to make it beautiful at the end. That's the essence of all this. So now I'll go along and uh, tie up the thread. Tie up the thread, go a second time to make it tight and strong. Okay, I'll use my scissors to cut it out. So next step now, I still have some of the 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 cobless flowers. So I'll go along now and then finish our decoration. Finish our decoration. I think I need a little glue here. Just a little bit of glue here to stitch it down. Yeah, I think it's okay now. So all we have to do, I'm still creating my flower, my bow. I haven't finished. You guys know the bow, you have to bring it out to show the bow. It's like true bow that you are making a bow tie, you know how it looks. You have to make everything look nice and beautiful. So you see, I have to place the flower this pattern. Just figure out how, which pattern to go for or whatever to do, just to make it beautiful and uh, yeah, that's the essence of all this. To create a lovely, nice, uh, nice thing at the end now i have to cut out some of the bow you see the pattern of this flower i can choose to cut it out one after the other like one one and place it one after the other but today i chose to go with the like the rectangular shape it's about design like i said before just figure out when you want to do this figure out whatever you can do just to make something beautiful it can be your old shirt or anything just make it lively again and uh, yeah so now i'll go i was i'll go now and uh, use my glue to glue down the the remaining flower you guys can you can see what i'm trying to do you already may looking at this, you can see the creation, the creativity, the creation, what I'm trying to create here. You can see that. So now you're almost done. So I'll go now and then stitch down, um, 
glue down the flower once you have a nice glue this glue it doesn't go away, go away like easily it can last for two three years i've been using this glue for for almost six years now since i started sewing so if you can get this glue anywhere whichever one that works works best for you you can go for it all you need is to just to glue down your work and that's all that's it so yes now it's coming together so I'll continue like this I will show you guys after this too yes as you guys can see we are almost done you can see the design can you see that look at this beautiful oh my goodness this is so pretty so now I'll go on ahead and place this. I'll place one of these to cover up the my sewing. Remember, I used the needle to sew down here. So I'll go ahead and uh, place this. I'll place it like so. And we are done. As easy as. All you need is to be creative. It doesn't matter any of your fabric laying somewhere in your house. You can choose to go with it. Just make something beautiful. Make something creative. Please, I would like you guys to um, show me your own video. When you watch this, think about what you, whatever you can do with any, of, any fabric lying around your house. Any leftover. It can be your old t-shirt, like I said before. Go with it. You can make something beautiful. It's all about being creative. So this is the end of our... We almost, we are done. You can see now. The t-shirt is ready. Look at. Oh my goodness. This is beautiful. This is... Oh my gosh, this is so lovely, pretty, pretty, pretty shared, pretty. Look at, we've changed the look of the, the entire look of this t-shirt. It used to be plain and the boring and all that. Now, look at, look at this. This is beautiful, gorgeous. So thank you guys for watching. This is at the end of our video. And you can equally uh use your needle to you know to stitch it down more to order in order to make it strong to last longer so yeah but if you have a stronger um, glue no need for that you are good to go it's washable and everything like this is the the the, the glue yeah they come fabric it's a permanent adhesive all right thank you guys for watching please click the like button and uh, oh, I would like you guys to make your own videos as soon as possible and show me. Please comment and ask questions. Mm -hmm. Anything you like, you can ask about this video. I'm ready to uh, reply to you. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys next time.